This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. So hi everyone, it's Raziel Kane. I'm just shooting. Um, maybe it's going to be a, a time lapse video. Just of how to assemble the lights for Vladivostok. I don't even know if that's uh, the pronunciation. Because on the box it's, it says, uh, Hey Shenway, hey hi Shenway. So I don't really know what's the official name for that company, which is Cyan Cultural, I guess. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna, basically this is what you get in the box. Um, I don't know if I'll do a, a proper review. No, I'll do a proper review, but I just want to shoot quickly what, what came in the box and how to assemble the lights which i have no clue i've never done um so uh, there's the instructions and in the instructions there's a section that says light installation and in which which type of light like where do they go so i think i'll be okay my problem is that It comes with all those microchips and the instruction just say this is a magnetic light this is a remote light this is a so gonna have to figure it out um, as I go and uh, hopefully I'll uh, be okay but uh, it uh, it looks okay it, it looks you know simple enough so we'll uh, we'll see what happens so I don't know if I'll speak for this section I'll probably not I'll just you know show you what I'm doing um, first we're gonna open this Deluxe told me be careful when you open that things tend to fly front of the remote, back of the remote, middle of the remote. I'm guessing these are the interrupters. So they're going to go that way. But I'm guessing you have to put the battery in first. And the battery seems to be this one here because it's the only one of that size. This way. You slide that in. Put it Like this, there's a, a side to it. There you go. Well, I hope I did that right because the remote is clipped to sh oh. clipped shut pretty good. So I'm gonna have a hard time pulling that out. But the remote is assembled for the guns. So basically you have two guns like this right and you remove this split it in two and there's the light this is the other part and now I have to look for weapon okay so it's this one here so this is the the lights are attached to it and what you do is you put this face down in here. With one light inside and then one light outside to reflect out of this thing here. But I'm probably going to have to put a battery in first. They don't tell you which size battery you need to put in but yeah they're all of the same size all right so I'm gonna shove one in there like this technically huh, maybe not or is it with this one on on this 
you have that little magnetic thing that that's supposed to oh yeah it does so this is not working with the remote it works you light it with the other gun okay so now when I go like this lights up well all right hold on I don't know how much difference the ring light makes but uh, here nope here uh, there you go. Come on. There you go. There you go. And that's it. That's how you become an engineer. I'm kidding, Vince. Oh, they're all the same. Okay. I thought, like, each of these little different square went with a different light but they're not because they're all the same microchip no they're not there's a couple different molds but mainly there's a lot of RX 2306A and RX 230518RX and haha this is for the they, these are for the light that work with the remote and the 6A work with the magnetic gun the chest the head the remote the weapons remote light magnetic light yep nope I, okay, this is all in Chinese, and I've used Google Translate to write what it's for. So, oh yeah, that's magnetic, that's remote. Okay, so, if I follow the instructions, this piece here goes in the back. Alright, you have to know where to look. Okay, so basically, this is here the building part. Uh, building like uh, it's too uh, let's uh, you see here this is a, a building like on uh, when you do the by the base so that's like a I don't know an apartment building or something so you have to put a light in there so there's a section here so I'm guessing this is gonna sit here with the light in front so you take this piece and I have no clue to know if it's going to be a magnetic or a remote. And this doesn't tell you. I'm going to guess remote. So I need one of these pins. Oh, maybe the there's going to be different connectors. Nah, they pretty much all look the same. Okay. No, remote is this one here. So I'm going to insert. Oh, there we go. All right. Small battery, and then I'm going to plug this in like that. Oh, there we go. So it looks like this. And then there's a size to it. So I'm um, in the camera. Okay, well, you can kind of see it. So if there's a lot of dots that you see, that's the back and in the front. And there's actually a texture for it. And then in the front, it's a little different. I think that here though, that's I think that might be a coffee stain. And that might be my fault. So this side is completely smooth. And this side is not. So I think 
I'll try to do it for you guys. So I did put the remote battery backwards. Uh, give me a second. Ah, there you go. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, wait. Oh, well, you can see it. Off. On. Off. <laughs> okay, so the remote works and that battery works. All right, so I'll flip it down, turn it around again. Okay, so that's one down. So that's that's remote and that's magnetic. Okay, next you have a remote light. It says on the back here. Ah, yes. Okay. So technically this is removable. There we go. Easy like that. So I take this. It's going to fit here. But then I take a remote pin. Put a battery inside. Ladies, it's just like your vibrators. And then, I don't know if you can see it, but there's two little pins. These go, like, upwards. I yeah. got to turn that back on. So here you have uh, two metal pins on one side, and on the other side it's just white. You want to put the metal pins up front so that they're looking at you when you shove them in uh, the pin here. And you have to give it a good push, but of course you want to be careful not to break it. So now before I install this, there you go, it lights up. little bit anyway oh and this thing okay so now in this one you have to put the light in first and i'm guessing there's a little dent here like a little hole right here so i'm guessing this is where the wires are going to come out of so now you have to be careful not to put it too far because you don't want it to hit the joint is odd. Okay, so let's take this one out. Oh, let's test the articulation. No problem. All right. All right. Does this one work? Yes, it does. Okay. All right. Next. There's really no difference in lighting. So I don't know why they say front and back. So whatever. It's going to go like this. Oh, no. This one's going to go downwards. What you might want to do is just put it inside the plastic. Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe I should have done that in the back. Live and learn, people. And then... Put the pin in, not the pin, but the microchip in, and you close it, and then you go, Wow, this is so cool. Okay, where's my other one? Nope, ah, just kidding. So, my guess is that if you want, you could pop everything with the magnetic uh, or the re remote. I don't know if there's enough. I, I I have three lights left after that. And there's like, I don't know, six, seven thing uh, of that's going to be extra. So I could use either, always use the gun or the remote. And I'm guessing if you want to save batteries, you use the gun. 
because um, there's only one battery for the remote. I have to say that since I've never done something like this before, I wish the instructions were way more detailed. Test. <laughs> There's one in his head. That's going to be fun. There's a square one. That goes in there. Sure. Why not? Okay. Remote. Yep, that's a remote switch. A battery. Oh, one thing I should make sure you don't have any static electricity on you, so touch some metal. That's a old boomer trick. Not boomer, Gen X, sorry. Okay, and this goes here. Oh, there you go. Yes, it does. And it's just a hole. So you take this. You take the plaque. And you, you can squeeze it in there pretty good. So I'm guessing, just like I did with these ones. So I'm guessing the one in the back could have done that. So I'm, I'm going to go back and do it. And then this really doesn't matter where you put it. Because if you take a look inside, it's just two pins that are going to hold it. And it doesn't seem to move. So... Like this, put it in there, because this moves, but it doesn't affect this, and this uh, opens up like this, so it's not affected by uh, where the chip is. Now let's test it. <laughs> okay. And then we have the feet. You guys see the feet? There you go. Okay, those, so these things in the feet. Oh, those are the ones that Deluxe Baldwin used. Um, oh, he said he pulled the wires out. Okay. There you go. Oh, I'm missing one. And that chest. Okay, for the chest. Okay, which one is it? Oh, this is for the head. Oh, yeah, there's one in the head, too. Did they show it? They did not show it. Yep, they did not show it. Just screw you guys, man. Just figure it out. So, this is for the head. Thank God for Google Translate. And this is for the chest. So one battery in the chest. There you go. You have one. Oh God, where is it? Wait, where's the light? Now oh, there it is. Yeah, but how is this light? There's no light there. All I have is this plastic thing here. How? Where's the actual light? Oh, oh, okay, that's my bad. There's a light in the middle of of the microchip itself. My bad, again, not an engineer. So this, you want to carefully place. It actually doesn't have to be carefully. It's just sitting on some pieces. Then you shove that in there. And there you go. Come on. I don't know. This one. Okay. <laughs> and then the head. The head has a space for three batteries. And there are smaller ones right here. I don't know if I can put it closer for you guys so that you can see a little better. I do this. So basically, I'm trying to fit this piece inside a small hole in there. 
because those two white thing here at the bottom those two white things these are the lights that are going to light up behind the eyes of metroplex there so and i can't put the batteries in the thing first because they're going to fall down so i have to install this and then i have to put the batteries in i think i got it okay and now ah man which side do i put the batteries uh so far they've been facing the microchip so let's keep with that oh with just two batteries maybe i have one spare please be that yeah i have one spare all right final test ah is it magnetic it is god oh man the camera quality is shit well there you go so that's the two guns the feet the chest the shoulders uh, this part here and then the light uh, the, the eyes and no, in the back the three sections so in city mode that's gonna look awesome all right so this is it sorry guys this is messy and i don't know if anybody's gonna actually watch this but this is how a complete amateur me was able to install electronics please comment that i am not good at this and that i should refrain from doing these type of videos or Say thank you, because, you know, thank you. Why is this light keep closing? Come on, feet. The battery's already dead, not bad. And the other one. Or maybe they're on a timer? No, I don't think so. Maybe it's just the feet. Whatever. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you did, please like, subscribe. God damn it. And hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. Love reading those. Keep coming back. I have more on the way. And remember, nothing in life gives you right to be an asshole. Come on! Take care.